Oh, yeah. Um, this story doesn't end how I thought it would two months ago. No. When Carl Wernicke emailed me. Oh, yeah, because... Gushing about how his dad and uncle, identical twins... They're part of aviation history. ...are kind of a big deal. I'm a big deal. Why do you... I don't mean, how, how did I get to be a big deal? I'll tell you how. Well, and that's a picture of me in that helicopter. Rod was a Navy pilot. Back to Korea. After that, he got a job at Bell Helicopter, working alongside his brother, Ken. Both were engineers, but a more appropriate label would be inventors. Ken was instrumental in developing the tilt rotor aircraft, which has been widely used by almost every branch of the U.S. military. In his free time, he invented a flying car. You know, he was doing all these home projects. He was pulling me in. <laughs> Together, they created the Fast Track Amphibian, a vehicle that can travel high speeds on land and water. This is a top. Even today, from his tiny apartment in Bedford, Rod is still tinkering. 70 degree quadrant. But the reason for this story wasn't their engineering, it was their birthday. They were born 90 years ago today. Okay. Unfortunately, soon after Carl sent me that email, his uncle Ken died following a stroke. Paper, I guess it was. When I met Rod, he was noticeably at peace. Okay. He says before working together, he and Ken spent nearly 10 years apart. After reconnecting, they grew closer than they'd been in decades, something Rod appreciates now more than ever. Yeah, I'm thankful. I wouldn't have had some of those experiences, yeah. Their inventions were revolutionary, but the greatest thing they created were memories. Yeah. In Bedford, I'm Sean Giggy. That picture with the Rangers.